Alright, this is Bailey Street, which is pretty much the heart of the east side, you know what I'm saying? It runs from north to south. Um, you know, like directional wise, but it's on the east side. So it's like the main pipeline through the east side. You know what I'm saying? Niggas think this life Daily, is fake. and then you got Genesee. Until you wake up and niggas is raking leaves up over your head. Six feet under. But anyways, that's the famous King City right there. Thunderstorms, hollow tip shells, nigga. A lot of people, especially from like New York City, never been down here. You know what I'm saying? This like Buffalo, it's like it's like being in one of the boroughs. You know what I mean? Like it's just it's just like a borough. You know what I mean? It's not a big city. Like it's not a huge city. Like I don't really know the size of Brooklyn, but let's just say Buffalo is just uh, like if they just took Brooklyn and moved it from New York City and just moved it upstate. I mean that's pretty much what it is. It's just a, it's a borough. You know what I mean? It's a small city. Everybody, everybody know each other, man. It's just so small. Like, a lot of times, man, some dudes, man, been to ran through so many chicks in the town. It's like, it ain't even no more options out here. I mean, it's, it's definitely always a, I mean, if you really look at it, like, you know, it's always new chicks out here, you know what I'm saying, but they just get ran through so quick, man, it just be like, damn, you know, you really can't trust none of these bras, a lot of these bras, you know, you don't even want to have no babies or nothing with them, because they, they scandalous as hell, you know what I mean, everybody just trying to come up, man, it's a real bad, poverty stricken place, growing up here, it's, it's a bubble, because you start to think that this is how it is all over the country, man, but once you start traveling, you realize, man, like, the grass is really greener in other cities, man. The city is real scummy looking, man. It's the hood spot right here. Buy here, pay here. You know what I'm saying? Always been here. Used to come here. You know, like, the dope boys and stuff come here, put, like, 500 down, 1,000 down, and make payments. Have a nice joint. You know what I mean? Here, go a couple other spots. All these kind of places always been here, so it's definitely easy to... To come here and just be like, yo, I'm going to fuck around and, and just buy me a little, you know what I mean, set up shop, buy me a little car. I'm not talking about no out-towners. I'm talking about, like, you know, niggas that's already here might just decide they want to jump off the porch or something. You know what I mean? Get you a little pack, pump that shit, get your bread up, then go to the spot on Bailey, get you a nice little... Look, you know what I mean? You don't want to jump out. Jump, you don't want to jump out the porch and, and get a, get something real expensive like no foreign and shit. You know, get you like a little deep boy joint. Little Buick, you know what I'm saying? Little little paint. Look at all these Look at all these fields, man. Look how many houses missing. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. It's no houses, here, man. It's like some streets only got like 2 3 houses on the whole street, man. This shit crazy. You know what I mean? And this the hood right here. We going into this the hood that the world famous Montana and Benny the Butcher. This is this is the hood. This is the hood he wears around his neck. You know what I'm saying? One thing I say about Benny, everything he's saying is real. This is Montana. We on Montana right now. Look at this. No houses. Look at that. Look at that. No houses. Tomorrow, man, no I'm houses on church. Montana, man. Look at this. Tomorrow, man, I'm going this to is the world famous Montana. Tomorrow, man, you know I'm going to church. I need some prayer. It's and no houses over here. Tomorrow, man, I'm going to church. And the crazy thing is, Tomorrow, this block not even this long. You see, we just turned on Montana Tomorrow, and we already at the end of it. Church. This block is not a long block. You know what I'm saying? But this is. This is this is this a real thorough block right here, man. You know what I mean? See that store right there? This is this a world famous neighborhood right here, man. For real. This shit like, you know, when you think about it, like 50 and shit when he came out and how they was, you know, talking about Southside Jamaica Queens. Man, listen. This is a whole nother type of Southside Jamaican Queens, man. Because niggas will blow your head back, man, and then go get lunch afterwards. You know what I'm saying? 
for real. For real. This is a barbecue spot, Ike's right here. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man, look at this, man. Look at it's, it's nothing but fields, man. It's spooky, man. This shit's spooky. Look how dark this shit look, man. Like, you know, the sun could be shining around here, and this shit still look dark, man. You know what I'm saying? All right, this is where Conway from. Here go May Street. This is May. May Street. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. He said he from May Street, the scary side. Let me tell you something, man. It's a scary neighborhood, man. Look at this shit. If somebody was running down on you, it ain't even nowhere to duck and hide, man, because it's just open fields. Niggas can come through with the lick and just blam that motherfucker, man. You know what I'm saying? Just blam that motherfucker like it's nothing. The devil got me, got me thinking I'm untouchable. Nobody can stop me. Look, all we just crossed Dope Street. He said the he said he's from May Street on the other side of Dope. That was Dope Street we just crossed through. You know what I'm saying? Now May goes all the way down there. And look at it, man. Look at this shit. You don't you don't wanna you don't wanna come to this city and think shit's sweet, man. You know what I mean? It's not sweet around here, bro. Tell you. Everybody, anybody from the town here know what I'm saying, know what I'm talking about. Anybody from Buffalo know what I'm talking about. All y'all from the city, New York City, and all the other cities and stuff, man, y'all can see what's going on, man. Griselda, them niggas is real. You know what I'm saying? Everything they talking about, they done did it. I'm not gonna say they doing it anymore, they not. You know, them dudes was getting money, they they done, you know, moved out the hood and everything. So don't get it twisted, man. Ain't nobody out here. On the block every day, but believe you me, this city's still popping. It's funny though because nobody never never thought that this city would blow, man. They really sleeping on this city, like they act like we don't even exist up here, man. But if you drag this city down, if you drag Buffalo down to like. New York City and, and connected to the boroughs. This man, I'm telling you, this used to be one of the third, most thorough parts of New York City. They'd be like, "Yo, don't go over there to Buffalo. Buffalo borough is crazy." Da -da 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 -da. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man, this is Bailey and Walden right here. See, I told you Bailey comes all the way down. We still, that's still Bailey. We just had, we cut off from Bailey and went up some side streets. But, but yeah, man, look at this. A lot of people is like They really fascinated with this shit, man Now we going up to like The Chihuahua borderline Like Chihuahua That's a That's a That's an immediate suburb Of Buffalo You know what I'm saying Don't get it twisted It get gully And motherfucking Chihuahua too You know what I'm saying It gets to get their head Blown back in the burbs out here Like for real This is how it go But um but yeah, I'm gonna cut back down one of these side streets right here. This St. Mary's. Um, mind you, we still on the east side, man. The east side is a big, just a big area, man. Like, that's where most of the, the gang activity is at and shit. You know what I'm saying? We get a lot of snow up here. A lot of, they use a lot of salt on the roads. So, in the wintertime, you don't want to drive your nice car or your nice truck because it's gonna get salt all inside the wheel wells and all, you know, it, it just ends up rusting the, the, the vehicle out. So we usually, like the smart people, you know, park your nice car or truck and just get you a winter beater for the snow. Cause it, man, we get like, man, we can get eight feet of snow overnight, man, 24 hours. I remember it snowed for 24 hours straight. And um, Buffalo. It snowed for 24 hours straight. I packed the stale for them niggas that man, be hating. Listen, it was like eight feet of snow. Tell me. People were snowed in, buried in. So, yeah, this is, this is just other hoods, man. Other parts of the, the east side. You know what I'm saying? Like, east side is pretty big. Like I said, it's, it's a big part. It's the, probably the biggest part of town, man. You know what I'm saying? As far as, like, it's urban. The urban part. You know what I mean? The rest of the, the city is different. Like, you go to North Buffalo and shit, that shit is, like, on the suburbs. Like, 
That's where you see like a lot of shopping plazas and stuff like that. Uh, South Buffalo is uh, it's a lot of white people in South Buffalo. Like that's what South Buffalo is notorious for being. It's just like a lot of whites. You know what I'm saying? But don't get it twisted. When you start thinking whites, like nah, these these is like thorough ass white people down there in South Buffalo. I remember uh, it was like a race war back in the day. Um, people, you know, down in like South Buffalo, Lovejoy area. Um, you know, we, we was like Witnessing on the news every day Like, motherfuckers was getting beat up You know what I'm saying? If you went down to South Buffalo The white white boys was beating Jumping niggas and shit You know what I mean? They kind of earned their own They earned their respect You know what I'm saying? Um, because they, I mean, they You know It just was a Two, both sides was like standing their ground, man. Like, cause you know, all all the niggas from this side of the bridge on the east side, we was like basically like you know looking at them like they was a threat or whatever. I guess you know I don't really know what the real origin was, but I know you ain't want to go down there. You know what I'm saying? Because you knew you was gonna have to get it popping with somebody, you know what I mean, and then it was the same over here, like, nigga, white boys was getting jumped and shit when they came over this way, so, um, it's a fucking trap, it just, it just one of them things, man, alright, we on Genesee, we almost at Bailey, we headed towards Bailey, this is a little hood tire spot, get a flat tire, you come here, you know what I mean, Now we about to go back up Bailey. Um, this is a part of Bailey that we didn't touch. Uh, well, we did, but this little stretch right here. This is an infamous area too, Bailey and Genesee right here. May Street is right down the street. We just looped around pretty much. That's all we did. But yes, yeah, it's, it's it's a different type of hood, man. Here, it's it's. It's hoods everywhere, man, all over the country, but it's just real spooky around this motherfucker, man. For real, I, w- I wouldn't even lie. Or as the as the youth would say, or as they would say down south, I wouldn't even cap. I wouldn't even cap, man. This shit's spooky, man. But you can see the difference too It's like When we was just on Benny's block Montana Like you see You see how like It was looking fucked up You know what I mean This is Bailey Like Bailey is like You know It's like the Las Vegas Strip When you come on Bailey If you got a nice car And you wanna really show that shit off You come down Bailey In the summertime man All the dots be on Bailey Cause it's a lot of little hair shops And shit man You ride up Bailey Listen, I man. That motherfucking shit. Be be up, uh, you get your little twenty twos, twenty fours, twenty sixes. Get them cleaned up and shit. Be riding them shit. Be chopping. You know what I mean? You wanna dry your shit down, Bailey, man? Cause you gonna bag mad chicks, man. These hoes be going crazy over niggas, man. Look at this, look at this, it's early, it's 9 o'clock in the morning, and look at this shit, police coming from every direction, east side shit, man, I don't know what the fuck going on, I'm about to come down, cut down here, let's see what's popping, let's see what's popping here, alright, we on Delavan now, this is Delavan, now this is BSF, you know what I'm saying, territory, BSF territory right here. You know what I'm saying? Infamous Newburgh. You know what I mean? The infamous Newburgh. You heard? Niggas better put some respect on the hood, man. You know what I mean? That name Newburgh, man. Niggas know that name. You know what I'm saying? For real. I'm a fire truck. I got no love for these niggas. Too early, man. Yo, niggas, listen, man. Niggas be getting whacked this early in the morning. Like, for real. Like, ain't no telling. Somebody might have just got clapped. You know what I mean? We about to go see what's going on. For real. Because, you know, Buffalo, man. Listen, man. This shit crazy, man. I remember somebody got murked. Matter of fact, right here. 
right here. I'm going to show you right now. I'm about to stop at this light. Right here. It was like 8 o'clock in the morning. Kids was getting on their school bus and shit. That pole right there, nigga, was slumped. And I remember the nigga on the top porch right in front of the shit. He was he was filming that shit. Like, nigga, you, seen the, you can see the body. That I, I saw it on Facebook Live. You know what I'm saying? I wasn't actually there. But you can see the body just laying in the street. I mean, laying like on the curb and shit. I'm like, I'm like damn, man, it's 8 o'clock in the morning. Let's go see. Let's see, what, let's see what's going on down here. This might be some minor yes. shit, you know what I mean? But you just get Why used to sirens and police lights and shit. Why they hating on the team? Regular these thing niggas right getting right. hacked and these niggas counting racks and these fake ass bitches know how to act. Yeah, Why they hating on me? Why they hating on me? Why they hating on the team? Cause these niggas getting stacked and these niggas counting racks and these fake ass bitches know how to act. Okay. No hesitation, these niggas hating regardless. Don't even matter, the moves I'm making is flawless. Why they hating on me? The definition of it. Everything that I do, I guarantee you love it. Super clean. They probably don't milk. You see that? You know, my father's milk that shit. No fermentation. Uh, no fermentation. No fermentation. That I'm ever falling. This the cheap boy on the borderline. We forever balling. Dying wife has been read at the boss table. The type of life I live, you won't see your cable. You will never be able to ever reach yeah, these heights. Unforgettable days, shit, unbelievable man. nights. Multiple accounts, you wanna know the amounts. Flip Big chips at casinos with my niggas the bounce. Why they hating on us? Guess you gotta see. Cause everything we are. I would love for this video to go viral too, just so motherfuckers can see. Why this town is, you know what I'm saying? I don't know, somebody might have already did this, you know, but this is my first, you know, and these niggas yeah, man, racks, and these fuck this life to the end of the post, right? Y'all niggas still talking, stop that, why they hating on me, why they hating on me, I ain't never got put over. Why they ain't no better than you? Because they got real shit they fucking in. These cops not riding around, but giving me people, uh, fucking, um, tickets with no seatbelt and shit like that. Or, you know, they, these niggas, do, they really fighting crime out here. They dirty too. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of dirty motherfucking cops. A lot of these niggas. They will come, snatch you up, like you go to trade for You know what I'm saying? This would be SLTF. You know what I'm saying? It's the barbershop. Thousand men. Liquor store. Everything in that plaza right there. You know what's crazy too? I remember in that plaza, there's like two kids, man, that got clapped up, man, because niggas came through and sprayed up the hood, man. You know what I mean? Randy Savage, man, if you hate Two little ass fucking little kids, man. Them niggas was young as fuck. They ended up dying, man. Like, they was head head innocent head bystanders, head man. Somebody came through with like a AK or some shit. Just spray that bitch, man. Blew that bitch, man. It's early as hell in the morning, man. You get woken up to sirens and shit. Like, the only other shit probably. Comparable. Only other place, I ain't gonna say city. Only other area is probably like Inglewood, man, like Southside Chicago. Like that shit is like just like this. Like niggas just get their top push back every day. Like, you know what I mean? They go uh, back on bed. You know what I mean? This shit probably look like uh, like one like one twenty fifth in in Harlem or something. Like hundred twenty fifth Street. It's like a parable to Ben, you know, like it's just a lot of stories and stuff like that.